Tomiotaki found her voice as a painter through a radical gesture of blinding, blinding her eyes and consequently blinding the image. Her first two works, done during the 1950s, were abstractions loosely linked to a school of Paris-like form of lyrical composition. But by 1962-1963, Tomiotake had begun her series of blind paintings. By blinding herself in order to paint, Otake was about to produce compositions that are, at the same time, accidental and intentional. Accidental because what one sees in the visual field was not conducted by vision, as the artist was suspending the very faculty of her vision, closing her eyes while painting. The compositions were not the result of compositional decisions, but of chance, and not a partial form of chance. Their totality, their image as totality, is the effect of chance. But they were also intentional, because the very decision of suspending vision, the very decision of closing her eyes in order to paint, was as such the most radical, intentional decision one can imagine. Untitled from 1964 is not a blind painting. However, to some extent, its background recalls some of the stormy images that were produced by the painter as she worked suspending her vision. By 1964-1965, Otake started also to produce collages. The first collages were done without tools, without scissors. She would tear with her hands the pages of magazines. She would tear down the image with her hands. Then she would use those fragments, irregular colored fragments of paper in order to compose her collages themselves as studies for paintings to come. The red and white shapes covering the background of Untitled 1964 are very similar to the shapes that Tomi Otake used in her first collages during this period. All happens like if in this painting Otake would have conflated an image coming from her blind paintings with the lyrical colored slightly formless shapes of her collages. Two moments, two practices, two temporalities of painting, two different sort of images conflate here. Moreover, two radical pragmatical decisions conflate here, blinding and tearing, or their consequences. Tomi Otake has brought painting and images to a borderline experience, and from there she was able to build her work, enjoying, like in this painting, the kind of freedom that only comes from the acquaintance to survival, from the proximity to exhaustion. <laughs>